Hello and welcome to another Raggies uh, barbecue review. Although the barbecue is on fire at the moment, and uh, I'm drinking some of this. So, 789 Rose. It's Mondelli Rosata, Sete Otta Nove, whatever that is. Um, this delicate rose wine is made from grapes grown in the sunny Puglian countryside, so Italian. Um, with its aromas of wild strawberries, zesty minerality and flavours of forest fruits, this wine is a great match for lighter seafood and fish dishes. 11.5% ABV. So, there we go. That's the wine. And, uh, yep, it looks like the uh, fire is out. Can't beat a barbecue with a fire going. Um, so, more or less a dull looking uh, rosé. You can see all the smoke coming up, can't you? Jesus. <clears throat> but yeah. So let me just uh, light it up again. And this time. Wasn't the best of starts to a review. Right. So, let that warm up a minute. Uh, you can't beat um, a barbecue review because. You never quite know what's going to happen. It's not like a normal review where you just sat there and drinking. Um, so yeah, nice. Uh, I'd say uh, there's a rosé tinge to it, but it's not your typical rosé. The aroma's light. Certainly getting that into hint of strawberry. Oh yeah, on the taste, certainly a bit of strawberry going up. Um, Right, so we're back on. So, there we go. Got the chicken and uh, burgers to put back on. Yeah, a minute ago, the whole lot caught fire. And, uh, yeah, not really what I wanted for cooking. Um, hopefully, that's it. And uh, yeah, no more shenanigans. Um, so, got this from Sainsbury's today. Four quid for the bottle. It's not a bad price for a bottle of wine, to be fair. Are you putting the music back on? No, There's a nice fruitiness to it. There's nothing too powerful on the fruitiness side of things. Quite drying on the taste. And, uh, yeah, just watching the old... Uh, so I've got chicken and I've got burgers on here at the moment. Obviously, it's one of the warmest days since June. Um, and, uh, so everything's came out of the free the fridge. It's now in in the uh, barbecue. Well, hopefully, and uh, we'll see how things go on that side of things. Um, as for the wine. Tasting really nice to be fair. A 
it's light, it's easy drinking. Um, 11.5% nice kick of ABV on there. And uh, yeah, trying to do, I'm trying not to burn anything. Oh, there's the thing. So, put this at the top side there. I've, I've cooked something it burns on the bloody barbecue or well, the barbecue sets a light um, so chicken burgers chicken and um, steak and vintage cheddar burgers so, that was that Dan oh. and uh, yeah wines are going down well Burgers are cooking. Though it sounds lively below me, so yeah. You can tell that um, yeah, there's a real kick in the in the barbecue today. So I'm just watching and making sure that it doesn't catch fire and we have burnt. Um, burnt burgers. And the same with the chicken, burnt chicken. We don't want no burnt chicken. So, had this for about four or five years now. We've, we keep going through them. For, uh, on the four or five year scale, this to be honest, it's probably on its last year. But uh, yeah, it's doing the trick and uh, that's all it needs to do really. Um, yeah. Sainsbury's finest, 789. Um, it's cheap and cheerful, Italian uh, wine. And uh, you know, at four quid, there you go, a bit smoky, at four quid a bottle, you can't fault it for the price. To be fair, even in the days that I worked at Sainsbury's, literally, um, oh well, on fire again. Um, Yeah, literally, oh God, eight years ago now, uh, it was only just about a fiver then, so in some ways wine, if you pick your wines, then they haven't gone down in price too much, or up in price too much, it's certain champagnes and that that I've done, so put this on like that, and uh, oh God, you can see the smoke. Yeah, I never did say I was a great barbecuer. Yeah. Would it have been better to clean the barbecue beforehand? Most likely, yes. And, uh, there's a nice smokiness getting into the um, into the burgers, into the chicken. And uh, as long as I don't go black from it. Yeah. Whoa. Right, and so um, a nice, gentle, fruity nose. Touch, touch of strawberry on the nose. A 
and the taste again gentle strawberry drying on the back end um, a gentle you know quite a nice fruitiness to it to be fair four quid a bottle can't fault it well, that's with your nectar card though because these days all the all the offers go through nectar what it is it's a grand way of nick and of, of telling them what you're buying every week nothing to do with bargains it's to do with them watching what you're doing if you buy that way uh, as for the wine yeah for me good 4.4 .4 out of 5 for the wine and uh, for the price pretty decent thank you for watching cheers